Right, before we get in, looking at the driver's door, um, we've got a button at the front here which is on a rocker switch. So clicking that one towards the out will bring the wing mirror in, clicking it in will put it back out again, and if you put it in the centre it will go in and out as you lock and unlock the doors. Below that you've got your, your knob here, if you turn it to the right and use it as a joystick it will move the mirror glass in the driver's side turn it to the left and it will do the passenger side and then back in the center so if you do knock it it's not going to make any difference and then you've got front windows rear windows your window lock in case you've got kids opening the window at the back and your door lock so as a safety feature the doors are going to lock once you get over 20 mile an hour and you can let people in and out doing that your petrol release cap is down there and then on the seat you've got pump up by lifting up pump down, go down, down and then your recliner on the back there. Got some more fuses in here under a cover you pop off and then above that we've got our headlight levelling, parking sensors off so you can switch your front parking sensors off when you're sat in traffic so that they're not constantly beeping if you're crawling along. The A off button is your automatic stop start so when the conditions are right in the car you're not drawing too much power and things when you get to a set of traffic lights and you sat there the engine will cut out and as soon as you dip the clutch again it will come back on again um, so you can switch that function off if you wish and electronic stability control above that which is obviously there for your safety so um, wouldn't necessarily switch that one off Right, I'm just going to get in the car and fire it up so we can move the wheel around right so to the right hand side of the steering wheel we've got our windscreen wipers we've got several settings on here so we've got intermittent when we go to intermittent that brings this internal roller into play if you set it at auto it will be automatic wash white windows then you've got double speed sorry normal speed double speed your rear windscreen washer is on there to wash the windows at the front you pull towards you to wash the rear one you push away there is a button on the end that says auto if you press that it will wash the front window twice so it'll go through the cycle twice for you the other buttons on the right hand side of the steering wheel is your cruise control so to use your cruise control if you're saying driving on the motorway you get to 70 mile an hour you press the button it will come up on the screen there auto cruise ready and then to set you literally just nudge that one forward you're now in cruise control and it will tell you you are you can then accelerate every nudge up is one mile an hour every nudge back is one mile an hour um, so you can set your speed you can cancel that by pressing off or by pressing the foot brake so if someone's pulled in front of you and you've had to slow down press the foot brake and then once you've got your gap you can press resume and it will go straight back into uh, cruise, cruise control at 70 mile an hour for you.